Hey moms with muscles, it's me, Chelsea. Today we're doing abs 101. It's nighttime, I just put my kids to bed, so I had to like get myself in the vibe to get this done. I have my candle, I have you, so let's do it. All right, we're gonna start with walkouts with a, with a little hold in that plank position like we did in our previous workout, okay? We're here for 45 seconds. And we're walking out. You just give me a little hold here. And back up. If you can't tell, I love walkouts. I think they're a great compound movement. Uh, they do a really good job of warming up your whole body, getting you ready to move. A little hold here. How are you guys doing? It's day three. This is awesome. I'm so proud of you. For everybody that's making the time, making the space to get it done. That's good. Let's do our next warm up move, okay? We're just gonna get on the floor on all fours and do some cat cows, all right? really stretch that spine here when you go up for your cat you're trying to make that big space by your belly button you're sucking your belly button in oh and then your butt comes up to the air your neck up and you feel that stretch in your lower t-spine We carry so many heavy things all day long, we don't even think about it. Those car seats are so heavy. Our babies are growing, the groceries. We just gotta get a little bit of love here before we turn up the heat, okay? That's fantastic. Okay, we're gonna do some Bird dogs. All right, for 45 seconds. Here we go. Opposite arm and opposite leg go up and then meet in the middle. Okay. We're gonna do, let's do 45 seconds here and then we'll switch it and uh, do the other side. Try to resist the temptation to be super wobbly. That's where that core engagement is coming in. That's where we're getting strong. Have you guys been using your calendar and checking off your boxes? All right, that was 45 seconds. We're just gonna go over to the other side right away. All right. I love a good um, box checked off. That's like my type A personality. <laughs> it just feels good. Like, did you really do anything? It's like you check off a box. Who's excited for ads? Who's dreading abs, huh? I have like a love-hate relationship with ab work. Cause like, it's important. We gotta do it. We're done with that. We need a strong core, right? To just live our lives. Um, but man, some of it sucks. But we're gonna get through it. We're gonna get through it together and it's gonna be awesome. We're gonna just, all right, so I have three sets for us. Each set has two exercises in it that we're gonna do for 45 seconds each, and then repeat. Let's get right to it. We're on the floor for weighted roll-ups. Let me show you what it looks like, and then we'll start all together. I have my dumbbell. If you don't have a dumbbell, you can do this without dumbbells as well, okay? We're holding it up above us. We're slowly coming up. 
with great posture. We're pausing a little bit at the top and we're rolling down slow. Okay, you guys ready to do this? All right, give me some good work for 45 seconds. Here we go, oh, we're on. Oh. You know, if I'm being totally honest, I think what I was nervous about with doing an app video was some of these exercises are difficult for me to talk through. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm gonna be really quiet for some of these. But hey, that's real life. And that's what real work looks like. And that's what I'm here to do with y'all is some real work, okay? <sighs> Okay, we're done. Fantastic. Hop on up. Our next move is gonna be standing twists, okay? It goes like this. Hands behind your head. They're glued there, okay? They don't move. And we're bringing our opposite elbow to our opposite knee, all right? And we're just switching. We should feel this in our obliques. All right, we're on for 45 seconds. As we go throughout this program, I'm gonna be supplying some extra content on the blog. So if you haven't already done so, you can go to medium.com and make a free account and follow me there for some extra fitness tips to kind of supplement the exercise and the work that we're putting in here. Ooh, okay, we're done. We're gonna repeat that. You know the deal, right? Okay, let's get down and do it then. Set yourself up. Either you have no weight, right? And you're going like this, or you're with me with the weight. Either way, we're on in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Oh, and my dog is making a cameo in this one. This is Bilgewater. Yes, you heard correctly, Bilgewater. Like the dirty water that comes off the back of a boat. <laughs> and we love him very much. Mostly we call him Bilge. And he is um, 14 years young. Okay, we're done. Stand up. We're going back to those standing twists, okay? That's not the deal. Three, two, one, we're on. I love a good standing ab move. It's easy on your neck, especially if you're just getting started with core work. And sometimes when we have weak cores and weak lower backs, and we're on the floor doing all of our moves, we put a strain on our neck. All right, almost there and we're done. Fantastic. Okay, that was our first set done and out of the way. Get a sip of water if you need it, okay? Okay, set number two, we're gonna start with some standing oblique work, okay? Um, you can get lighter weights 
if you have them. If you don't, that's fine. You, <laughs> this move, you'll feel it without weights. We're gonna spread our legs a little wider than hip width apart. Point, toes, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> toes pointed outwards, okay? Give me a little squat here, and we're going side to side, okay? We're there for 45 seconds. And if you don't have weights, I just want you going really far down. You're squeezing your core. Almost to where, if you're talking, you sound like uh, this. <laughs> we look a little ridiculous, but <laughs> we're getting in some work. We're gonna snatch these sides, y'all. Okay, we're done. Whew. The next move, we're down on the ground in plank position. You're gonna pick the plank that challenges you the most. Okay, if you're on your knees, you're on your knees, that's fantastic. If you're up by your toes, that's where you're at, okay? But you're gonna get a weight or a toy or something. And we're going to use our opposite hand here to drag it to the other side. Other hand, dragging it over here, okay? If you're on your knees, same thing. Either way, our butt is staying down and our hips are staying stable. We're not going all over the mat, okay, when we do this. We're here for 45 seconds. Get yourself set up in your plank and let's go. If you are up on your knees or up on your toes, something to remember. If your feet are wide, it's gonna be easier. If your feet are closer together, it's gonna be more difficult. So, find a spot that challenges you and meets you where you're at. All right, we're almost done. If you're on your knees, try stepping up to your toes right now, okay? Okay, we're done. Very good. <sighs> Starting to get a little warm here. We're gonna go back to our standing oblique crunches. Get your weights or whatever you've got, maybe some soup cans, maybe just your fists tent clenched tightly. And we're on for 45 seconds. Let me know how you guys like, um, the use of dumbbells. Do you guys have dumbbells at home? Um, do you want to see more body weight stuff? I like using dumbbells because I feel like you can do more quicker. You know, like you can get in a really great workout a lot faster if you're leveraging equipment like this. Oh, okay. This is coming off. Ain't hey, that kind of show. Okay. Okay, get your dumbbell all set up, but we're going down to the floor, okay? We don't need big breaks here. This is short, sweet, and to the point. Are you in your plank? All right, good. Let's go. For 45 seconds, we're dragging. We're dragging. We're moving. Okay, y'all, grade me. Look at me. Are my hips down? My butt is not in the air, right? My hips should be down. I shouldn't be 
moving gravy all over the place. I should be stable and strong. What do you do if you start on your toes and you start to feel like your form is deteriorating? Well, we're strong, smart women. We assess and readjust. You go down to your knees so you can keep going. And we're done. Woo wee. All right, I'm glad that's done. I'm glad that's done. Okay, our last set. Oh, these are fun. These are not fun. We have leg lifts and eagle crunches, okay? We're gonna go through it twice, 45 seconds each. So let's just get to it. We're going down on our backs. You guys know what leg lifts are. Down and up. Okay? Um, I only want you to take your legs down as far as you can go without your lower back coming off from the ground. Okay? Because when your lower back starts to come off of the ground, that's when we're straining that area and and we're not doing what we're trying to do. We're just focusing on our lower ab, our little uh, fupa area, right? Um, so let's get to it, right? If you also, wait, stop. <laughs> also, if you need to, you can take your hands and put them under your butt for a little extra support, right? All right, let's go. You can relax your head. And this move is gonna look so different for everybody. Can I just be really real with y'all for a second? Okay, here it goes. You won't get this kind of talk with all the cutesy instructors. This is like a farting move. <laughs> Like this is the move that you you do and you can like work something up. Okay. Whew. Okay, fantastic. We're done. I'm gonna do eagle crunches, okay? Eagle crunches are weird, but stay with me because these attack the middle abs, which is sometimes a hard area to really hone in on. <clears throat> We're going to cross our legs. If all you can do is just cross them once, like you're sitting in a chair, that's fantastic. If you can go ahead and do one more hook under there to hook your leg under your calf, amazing. Arms are doing the same thing. We're twisting our arms, okay? And you're giving me a crunch like this, okay? They're not easy. <laughs> but we're going to get through these 45 seconds together. If you need to slow your pace down and take a little mental break in between each rep, do it. Do what you have to do because I'm going to have to do what I have to do to get through this, okay? Here we go. 45 seconds and we're on. See, I'm quiet. I can't be, I can't be talking to you. Whew. Okay, we're almost there, guys. We're almost there. That burn you're feeling? That's progress. Okay, we're done. Fantastic. This is a great little combo, right? Loving this. Woo! Oh my goodness. Okay. I'm oh, sorry, I can't sleep. Let's do this. We're gonna go back for our leg lifts, okay? And if you need a modification for that, it's just right here. Your legs are bent. 
and you're giving me a march in action. Okay, one at a time. Okay. So wherever you're at, we're on in five, four, three, two, one. If I don't cover modifications for a move that you're really struggling with, I'd love to connect with you and talk it through, figure something out because there's always a different way to get the job done. Okay, we're done. Oh, I set a timer on my watch. And so when the time is up, my wrist like jingles. And I just, oh, I was waiting for that. <laughs> Hi, everybody's favorite move, eagle crunches. Wrap yourself up in the opposite way of what, how you did it last time. And just see how that feels. Our bodies are not symmetrical. And you'll be amazed. Woo! At what you notice with balance and strength. Okay, a couple more, guys. Woo! I'm feeling the burn. my timer because what we're going to do for our finisher is hold a plank for a minute. Um, you could definitely do this. All right. So don't tell, don't tell me you can't do this. Wherever you need to be, if it's on your toes or your knees, we're going to stay there. We're gonna stay there for a full minute, okay? And this is the last thing we're doing, so we're just gonna go ahead and start. Okay, ladies? All right, set yourselves up. Three, two, one, here we go. And we're just, we're comfy here, okay? You see a little correction that I made? I could see myself in the um, camera and I lowered my hips. Our hips should be low, we should be like a straight line here. Woo. I'm so proud of you. I am so, so proud of you guys for doing this. You're doing this. You're doing it. It's not easy to find the time to do this, to find the energy to do this, and you're prioritizing it and you're making it happen. So you're getting stronger in a lot of different ways. Hey, guess what? We're done. <laughs> You guys just completed an ab killer. We got the sides, we got high abs, middle abs, low abs, we did it all. We fired up our core, 
You put in hard work. You did hard work. And I'm so proud of you. It's like an honor to get to share these workouts with you guys. All right, we're gonna do just a little stretch here, okay? Bring it into a up dog. Oh. To stretch out those muscles. Good morning, coach. Okay. God bless you. Lay down on the ground here and, and put your arms out so you look like a T. We're gonna put one of our legs down and drape your other leg across your body and reach across the other side of the room. You should feel a nice stretch in that T-spot. You can give me a little circle around the floor. So we're opening up. Making it a little Oh, sorry, Bill. <laughs> Making it a little dynamic. <sighs> Bill is old and grumpy. He don't like to be bothered. So he got a little nippy with me. <laughs> Let's do the other side, okay? Oh, I got a crack. Oh, that feels so good. Okay. We're going up and over. We're painting a rainbow. today you guys good work today i'll see you tomorrow bye